Hello, this is Troy Deitmeyer, I'm field agronomist for DuPont Pioneer here in Northeast Iowa, and today is May 24th, and we are near Maynard, Iowa in Fayette County, and was just wanting to visit with you briefly about maybe some of the things you're seeing in your soybean fields that may be treated with Alevo seed treatment. Alevo seed treatment is a fungicide seed treatment that helps us with the fusarium strain that causes sudden death syndrome. And one of the things that we see with that year in, year out is what we call the halo effect. And what I'm doing is I'm looking down the split on your right, you see an untreated uh, variety of soybeans and on the left is the same variety with the Levo seed treatment. And one of the things that I'll try to zoom in here and hopefully it shows up fairly well on the camera is we have what we call this halo effect occurring on our cotyledons that emerge and you can see uh, right in here, right there, we look like we have almost some type of leaf burn or some type of herbicide injury. And you can see here this next plant maybe uh, is a little bit further behind coming up and has that. Well, you know, along with this halo effect right here. And what that is, is that's just the seed treatment um, having some activity on these early soybeans uh, compared to when you come over here and you look at the untreated soybeans and you don't see that halo effect you know around these cotyledons and some people have been calling and they're pretty concerned you know about some of the burn that we're seeing on, on some of these cotyledons and things like that and uh, this is very typical of what we see um, we've been testing the levo for several years now and we typically do see this halo effect and the cool damp weather is probably uh, increasing the amount of burn that we're seeing on these. Uh, it looks similar to maybe some PPO uh, soil applied herbicides that will get some burn on from them as well. But I can uh, rest assured this is something that uh, is just cosmetic and will not last long. We get some sun and some heat and these new unifoliate leaves will be coming out. And you can see here on this bean here that's actually just a little bit more advanced. It does still have some of that effect on the cotyledons, but you can see the new unifoliates are just fine. So you give, give these plants here another four or five days of hopefully some of this predicted warm weather and sun, and we'll soon see these uh, symptomologies disappear. And I do think with the cool wet weather that we've been having, the Alevo seed treatment will be something nice to have in our uh, package to help prevent sudden death syndrome showing up later on in the growing season. If you have any questions or comments, be sure to give us a call and contact your local Pioneer sales representative. Thank you.